Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will show you how to answer this one. We need to find about complementary solutions and particular solutions. So in this one, I will put yc that is about e to the power of lambda s later that we need to find first the derivative of yc that is about lambda e to the power of lambda s because if i do first the derivative of this one we keep the same e to the power of lambda s later that we need to do first the derivative of lambda s. You got this one. Now we go to second. The derivative we got lambda square e to the power of lambda s, and third the derivative of y c, and we have lambda to the power of three e to the power of lambda s. This is about complementary solutions. So I will put this one equals to number 0. So I will put this one going here and this one going in here. Now, we can do about factorization by e to the power of lambda s. So we need to find the solutions of this one. So we can do about factorization by lambda square. So for this one, we have lambda equals to number 0, lambda equals to number 0, and lambda equals to negative number 3. So in this one, we have yc that is about C number 1, e to the power of 0 s. We need to transform lambda into number 0, and we got number 1. So, because we have same number 0, so we have C number 2, s, e to the power of 0 s, and this one we have number 1. And the next one, we have C number 3. That is about the constant number 3, e to the power of negative 3s. And this is for yc. Now let's go to particular solutions. Because we don't have third derivative, first derivative of y and original of y. So, because the highest power that is about number 2, so they start at second derivative. They start at second derivative in here. So, in this case, we need to put about yb, and that is about 8s to the power of 4. So, we put the highest power, we plus the smaller the derivative that is about number two in here so two plus two we have number four because if we do first and second the derivative they will reduce the power from number four to number two so that's why when we put this one going here 
you will got about x square. So the next one that is about b s to the power of three and c s square. We can stop in here because in this one they have s and number one. So we just start from s to the power of four to s to the power of two. So when we do first. First, the derivative of y b we have four eight s to the power of three. This one we have three b s square. This one that is about two c s. We go to second, the derivative of y b, and we have twelve eight s square. This one. That is about 6BS. This one, that is about 2C. We go to the last one. That is about 24, 8S. 6B. This one, that is about the constant. So you got number 0. So I will put this one go in here so this one I will put in here and this one I will put in here Now, we need to simplify it. So, number 3 with number 12, we have 36 AS square. Number 3 with number 6, we have 18 B and 24 8. The next one, 6 B and 6 C. Now, we need to compare coefficients. So, we can see that we have S square. We have S square. So, this one equals to negative 36. And this one equals to number 12 and this one equals to this one now we need to find the solutions of A, B, C. So, 8 equals to negative number 1. B equals to number 2. And C equals to number 5. So, we put A, B, C. Go back in here. Now, we need to combine YC and YB. So, we have the final answer.
this is the end thank you for watching